Hi, I'm Margaret Gardner from South Africa. Good morning, Tobias. It's so Hello. lovely to How see you. How are you doing? Nice to see Very you. Very well, thank you. Um, so, watching this series, His Royal Highness Prince Philip is the only one that's kind to Princess Di. Was that based on fact? And also, how direct are you? Do you tend to be blunt uh, like he is? Or do you soft pedal your comments? No, I wish I, I, I admire his bluntness and I, I think I probably, um, I probably soft pedal more than I'm blunt in, in my own life. Um, um, yes, I think, um, yeah, the version that we tell in this, uh, in this season is that he really takes a shine to Diana and is a, sort of a, an advocate for her and a, a supporter of hers. Um, well, somebody had to. Nobody else yeah. in the family seemed to. Yeah, doesn't it? Yeah. And, that, um, and this season doesn't really uh, change the dial on that very much. When we saw you in London just before shutdown, um, you had mentioned that you uh, enjoy nature. And that's one of his traits, that he's most comfortable in nature. And you told us that you had recently climbed a tree. So is that something that you do naturally? Was that an area that you connected with him maybe, being in nature? Yeah, I hadn't thought of it like that, but yes, I, I think it's, you know, I was brought up in the country, so, and I think that never really leaves you. There's a bit of you that kind of relaxes when, you know, when you are out in nature. And it definitely seems to be something that he goes to and enjoys and, you know, um, has, yeah, spent a lot of his life doing, you know, um, it, it, recreations that I don't necessarily do, but, you know, hunting and shooting and, and riding, etc. cetera. But, tree um, climbing? <laughs> yeah, I don't know how, what, how much of a tree climber he is. But, <laughs> but you like to do uh, that? It's something I, guess, I do. Yeah, I mean, I, um, yeah, I spent a lot of my childhood climbing trees. So, yeah, and I, I yeah, I, I, um, I wish I did it more, but, um, you know, You've been in so many iconic shows, um, Outland, Game of Thrones, this. When you leave, um, how much of a character stays with you? Um, completely honestly, uh, very little probably. Um, mm. I'm not, you know, um, yeah, I mean, I like to take the role seriously and really go into it, but no, I, I've never quite subscribed to this slightly esoteric idea that um, somehow it kind of inhabits you in a, in a sort of um, voodooish kind of way. Um, that's not my experience of acting. I don't, um, no, I don't, I don't wake up just, in the morning kind of thinking of thoughts. But, um, it's yeah. all just natural. Huh? Um, actually, at the beginning of lockdown, I mm. did a podcast with you. And yes. you had mentioned that you were spending your time remodeling your kitchen and cooking. Mm. And I was very remiss in not asking you what you're cooking. So no. how are you managing the continued lockdown and what are you cooking? <laughs> um, yeah, so we've just gone back into lockdown for a second time oh. uh, here in London um, as of tomorrow morning, in fact. So, so we're going to do another kind of month. Um, what am I doing? Uh, yeah, so, and yeah, I moved back into my place uh, sort of in March uh, and I have a new kitchen to play with, which is, uh, yeah, been a real, yeah, a, a real joy. Um, I've got some cookbooks. I'm a bit, uh, a bit pedantic about it, I think. So I sort of get the cookbook and I, you know, I choose a recipe and I go and buy the stuff and I follow the rules of the, so I'm, um, I haven't quite got the confidence to kind of just be sort of throwing stuff together, but um <laughs> And it's mainly been kind of savoury stuff. I haven't quite got into sort of baking cakes yet. But, yeah, watch this space. <laughs> Thank you so much. Do you want to say something to your fans just because they followed you from show to show and this has been just yeah. such a great season. Um, I don't think you're coming back the next season, right? No, no. So we're all, uh, we're all stopping in a, some some new rather wonderful actors are being lined up to, to carry the story on. Um, but yes, no, uh, you know, of course, any, anyone who is interested and excited by uh, my work and comes and, and, and watches, you know, is um, 
I'm, you know, I feel very kind of um, humble and blessed to have people that are interested in and watching my work. And I know that there are people who have, you know, got to know me on different shows such as Outlander and, and Thrones and, you know, and now kind of consistently follow my work. And uh, yeah, I feel pretty lucky to have that. So well, thanks. Always a pleasure watching you. Thank you so much for your time. Cheers, Margaret. Bye. Bye.